Welcome Capricorns, I'm back with another video. So yes, this is going to be a general read. It may or may not resonate with you. If this message resonates, guys, be sure to hit the like button as well as share with your family and your friends. And don't forget to subscribe if you are new. All right, I'm the Empress. I'm here to do this general. Like I said, whatever pops out is what's going to be discussed, okay? Whatever pops out. So let's see what's going on with the Capricorn, Sun, Moon, and Rising. Please give me a message for the Capricorn. What's going on with the Capricorn? What's going on with the Capricorn? All right, so we're going to start right here. Okay, we got the star here at the bottom of the deck. Okay. All right, let's see what's going on. All right, we got the Knight of Swords and the Moon, Eight of Pentacles, the Ace of Pentacles, the Sun, Ten of Wands, Six of Cups, and Strength, Page of Swords, and the Empress. Ooh. Okay, so we got the Empress could be dealing with a... Libra or Taurus. We got strength here. It could be dealing with the Leo. We got the sun here. Definitely picking up Leo's energy right here. And we got the moon. Could be dealing with a Pisces or a Cancer. What I'm also picking up here as well too. You got the moon and the sun here. Something could be exposed or brought to the light. Something that I'm hearing was done in the dark comes to the light. I'm seeing that for sure, for sure with this moon and the sun right here. Also, what I'm picking up as well, too, is someone could be pregnant. You could find out that someone is pregnant. You could be pregnant. Okay. I also see, too, like you're hoping somebody is, like, watching. Okay? you like, I hope you see it. I hope you see it. Okay? I hope you see it, boo-boo. You see it. <laughs> All right, so let's see what's going on because your energy, you're a little irrational right now. Okay, like, so what's going on? It's like some, it's somebody, I'm also picking up too that someone could be trying to run back to you or an ex is returning or you're trying to go back to an ex. I feel like something was, okay, let's, let's just get into it. Tell me about this Eight of Pentacles. You've been waiting on this person to try to run back to you. Mm -hmm. You've been waiting on this person to try to run back to you. Okay. Um, You could have seen that this person is doing, trying to get your attention, like kind of flirt, trying to flirt. Trying to do be a little flirty. Yeah, I'm getting like you you wait you been you <laughs> you been waiting on this person to try to come back. Okay, what is this? Tell me why this ace of cups is here. Okay, you feel like this person's going to have to apologize first. They got to apologize first. Like, they don't come, got to come to you correct. If they ain't come to you correct, it's a no. But you've been waiting on me. You've been 
seeing the signs like this person could be giving you some type of signs or something that they want to come back around I feel like you're here for it too. You've been waiting on me. Why is the Knight of Swords here? Yep, didn't I tell you? Seven of Pentacles. You've been being real patient. You've been being patient. Like, just waiting on it. Waiting on this person to reach out to you. Waiting on it. Real deal waiting on it. Why is the moon here? Why is the page of wands here? Okay. I feel like it, I feel like you kind of like have regrets how this this situation panned out. Okay, we got five of cups in the tower and the judgment. You kind of have regrets about how this fell apart. Like it fell apart. Spirit came in. I feel like this was something that had to be done um, to kind of like slow things down a bit, change up the rhythm of things. Um, I feel like secretly. You've been wanting to talk to this person. I feel like that's a challenge. Like, on the low, you kind of been wanting this person to reach out to you. You've been wanting this person to reach out. But you feel like they need to apologize to you. They need to apologize. Yep, then I tell you, they need to apologize first. Okay? They need to apologize first. You want them to reach out to you first. Because you, you caught in the middle. So you don't want to take no risk at this time. Because you caught in the middle. You in the middle of something. I feel like you're are, you're in the middle of a situation. The situation is could be a little messy. Okay. So you feel like they need to make the first move. They need to make the first move. And they need to apologize. Somebody's heart and somebody's friend statuses. We got the six of pentacles and the lovers and the three of cups and the justice and the knight of cups, four of pentacles. This could be something that you don't approve of. You feel like that's like being sneaky. You feel like that's being sneaky. I definitely do see like a, some friends being involved. Like, this could be something that's going on on social media. Why is the cherry here? It could be a cancer. Yeah, so you started, until this person gives you an apology, you decided, you decided to, to go on this new journey, okay? You already started a new journey. You already started a new journey. I feel like you still have regrets about the situation because I feel like there was an argument and then there was an ending. Like, it was a total ending. Ten of Swords is, like, total. It's a total loss. It's an ending. Somebody could have felt betrayed, stabbed in the back, hurt. Like, it was a bad ending, okay? Um, I feel like some truths got out. Yep. Somebody's truth came out. Somebody left, okay? Now, the sun is here in the past energy. You could have been being real positive. You know, you're feeling real good. You've been having fun with life. I feel like you're just having fun, okay? You're having fun. Nine of Cups. I feel also feel like you want to see this person again. I feel like you want to see this person again. You want to meet up with this person again. I feel like you still hold on to this person's energy. 
okay? I feel like you you left, like the passion could have left from this connection, but for some reason, I feel like you still hold on to this person. You still hold on to this person. I feel like y'all had some fun times together. Why is the four of pentacles here? Yeah, I feel like you hold on to this person even though y'all not together. Two of Swords and a Ten of Pentacles. Now, why is the Ten of Wands here? Yeah, see, the Ten of Wands and the Five of Pentacles. I feel like this is something that either you, you, I don't feel like this is something that you really necessarily want to let go of, but you feel like it could be time for you to let go of this. Why is the five of pentacles here? Yeah, the king of cups. You feel like it's a lost cause. Like, you feel like it's a lost cause. Like, you feel like... You feel like, okay, maybe it's time for me to let this go. You know, everybody change, changes. You know, you can't make this person reach out to you. Um... I feel like you, you're kind of looking at it like, you know, maybe I should have gave this a little bit of thought before I made this decision. Maybe the situation could have been fixed, but I feel like you took some type of risk, some type of leap of faith um, because you didn't want to argue over. It looks like you didn't want to argue over money. Maybe that could have been the issue. Um, I feel like you just regret the whole situation. You wish you would have known this. Um, known this information before you decided to walk away, but you felt... Like, you know, you was doing the right thing at the time. Now, your energy is the Six of Cups. You're feeling real nostalgic. Yeah, see, you're still stuck in the past. The Eight of Swords and the Six of Cups. Waiting on this person to uh, come back to you. You know it's going to happen one day. You're just keeping the faith that it will. Like, you know this person going to come back to you one day. It's in your mind, like, you feel like that. Like, yeah, this person going to return. They going to come back, but they going to make the first move. I feel like that's the challenge. You being the one to reach out first to this person or waiting for this person to reach out to you. That's confirmation. Why is the eight of swords here? Yeah, the tower and the eight of wands. See, you just you just waiting for this person. You waiting for this person's name and number to pop up on your phone. You've been waiting on me. But because I feel like you needed to slow down in some certain area. I feel like you were kind of like going back and forth in between this person and another person possibly. And I feel like you kind of had regrets. You knew, I feel like you knew what you was doing. You felt, or you felt like this person knew exactly what they was doing. But at the time, it just was like a stressful situation. Yeah. It's like, <laughs> everybody would be surprised if you were to go back to this person. I feel like you love this person. We got the lovers, three of cups, and the justice. I feel like you would love to balance this this situation out. But I feel like you're giving it thought. Like, these are thoughts. Like, you, you're being real nostalgic. But you you feel like maybe this is not the relationship for you. So some of y'all are deciding to move on. And you're going to take it as an L. You're going to take it as for what it is and get the lessons out of it. But I feel like you may have heard that this person has some other options. So you haven't. This person, somebody didn't accept the offer. 
We got the four of cups and the knight of cups and the queen of cups. Somebody didn't accept a phone call or didn't respond. Maybe you reached out to this person, this person didn't respond, or this is vice versa. I'm getting like somebody not responding or somebody declining the offer. Somebody could have changed their number. We got the wheel and the ten of cups. Um, I'm getting somebody could have changed their number. This person could have changed their number. So this person that you could be dealing with, they could be a Leo. You got the strength card here. Or this person is very um, much so have gained their confidence, gained their confidence back. Could be a water sign, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio with this Queen of Cups energy. They're doing very well for themselves. Um, and they... They feel like they kind of want to like slow. They wanted things to slow down. I feel like there could have been third party issues with the Seven of Swords and the Queen of Wands. So they wanted to kind of like do something for themselves. This person could have been waiting for you to make the decision. Tell me why the Queen of Cups is here. Justice could be a Libra. I feel like this person also thinks that if they were to return, they don't know if they if if how that would go. So they're just this kind of like in the same state as well. We got the King of Swords and the Knight of Wands. I feel like they think about returning from time to time, but they don't want to give you this. They don't want to give to this connection right now. And I feel like their intuition is telling them to keep this chapter closed. Um, this person could have told you that they love you. We got the eight of wands and the lovers, um, but they just don't want to regret the relationship. They don't want to have any regrets. Why is justice here? And I feel like for some, this is a karmic situation. Like, I'm hearing what goes around, comes around. Like, I feel like both of y'all still are still connected to each other. But it's something most definitely happened in this connection that both of y'all could still be feeling some type of way about it. And this is kind of like trying to keep distance from each other. Um, trying to let the situation pan out, pan out itself. Why is justice hard? The high priestess. Yeah, this person is could be studying. I'm hearing that as well, too. Um, this person also knew the truth the whole time. We got the King of Swords, Six of Swords, the Three of Wands. Um, they knew the truth. They knew what was going on the whole time. That's why they didn't. That's why they, they were so in and out. That's why they, there was a lot of inconsistencies in this connection. When the offer was brought to the table, this is when it shook up. Nine of Swords and the Five of Wands. Um, and I feel like some type of truth came out. They felt like you didn't give them much to work with. Um, so they, they could have left. You could have left whoever walked away from the situation. This person here, they knew the truth. They had to gain their confidence back. Okay, they had to gain their confidence back. Yep, I told you, High Priestess and the Ace of Swords, this person knew the truth the whole time. They just didn't say nothing. Look at this, Four of Cups and the Eight of Wands. They were having really, really bad, they regret, they regret, have so many regrets that I'm getting like guilt. They didn't want to force you or make you in something. And I feel like 
there could have been some juggling going on with that two of pentacles and the seven of swords so they may have gotten they may have moved into a new city a new place we got a nine of pentacles the fool and the four of wands and the queen of pentacles they they had to go and do something for themselves but they're saying look this don't change how i feel about you that i just had to leave for my sake okay for my own sanity but this person here they knew the truth they just didn't say anything i feel like this person um I'm gonna see. I definitely want to see how this person feels about feels about you. Like this person here knew the truth and they didn't say nothing until the truth got out for whatever reason. How does this person feel about Capricorn? You don't know how hard it was to let you go. But this person is grateful for the spiritual lesson. So this person has grown from this situation. It was hard for them to let you go. Like it was really, really hard for them to let you go. But they're grateful. They learned their lesson from this situation. And I feel like this person, they still think about you. We got so many things remind me of you. They still think about you from time to time. But they, they... It was hard for them to to let this situation go. I feel like it was hard on both of y'all, to truth, truthfully, be honest. All right, so I feel like you could be watching this person and keeping an eye. Can I have to pay the swords here? Kind of possibly seeing what this person is, who this person is dealing with. How this person acts when they're not around you. We got the Empress here, Knight of Pentacles, and the Seven of Wands, okay? The Empress is motherly energy as well, too. Someone's mother could be involved. Because I'm getting a mother and a son. Okay, the Empress and the Knight of Pentacles. This person also, let me tell you, this person, this, some, one of y'all, it's a blame game here. I'm clearly seeing that. It's a blame game. Like, someone is saying, oh, you messed this up. No, you messed this up. No, you the one who did such, 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 such. No, you did. Let's not forget what you did. Oh, these, it's sound like a, all this honking and, whew outside it's a lot of lot going on outside but i'm hearing that like it's a blame game you did this you did that that's not gonna get that's not gonna get nowhere someone's mother could be forcing them to get a house or get get married why is the four of wands here Okay, no, someone's mother forced them to move out. Someone's mother, aunt, sister, somebody is influenced this person. Could be a queen of wands, Leo, Sagittarius, Aries. I definitely do see that this relationship was stressful. Like somebody was pushing this person to um, telling them that this relationship could not work. You need to think about the reason that you left. Um, 
Don't don't put no energy into that. Don't fall for it. Make an offer and then I'm saying because we got the magician, knight of cups, and the five of wands. So that's some like make an offer and then screw it up. Okay. Someone's baby mother, someone who this person could have a child with, kind of force them to look at the situation. Yeah, and this person, I see you could have got tired of of uh, begging this person to do the right thing, or you got tired of asking this person for help or stability. Um, it's just a lot of back and forth going on. So a lot of this doesn't even make sense. Like the way that this this connection fell apart, it still doesn't make sense to you to this day. I feel like you you just been working yourself, overworking yourself. Some of y'all work overnight, uh, trying to figure out what went wrong in this connection. I think you think about this person all the time, but it was a it was stressful. Nine of Swords and the Lovers. And stressful. Yeah, I feel like you could have, you feel like you and this person could at least be friends. Like, y'all could at least be friends. Yeah, I feel like this is somebody that you, you miss. Um, you miss the friendship. And then the lovers, yeah. You would love to be friends. You would love to be friends with this person. But see, it's a little bit of stuff. It's it's kind of like either this person could have blocked you or you blocked them. Um, it's like, how is this person, how are y'all going to connect with each other if, if you guys can't even get in contact with each other? You got to get creative. If this is something that you want, you want to reach out to this person, you feel like, you owe this person an apology or this person owes you an apology. I feel like it needs to be talked about. I feel like this is something that you guys have been having on your mind for a while that you just kind of like didn't have the courage to actually put that foot forward to do. But I feel like if it's something that's on your mind that you feel like you need to get off of your chest so you can go to move to the next level, have that closure that you need with this person, um, and at least at least try to at least be friends like end it on a good note and i feel like that's something that you want to do something that while you are possibly still stuck in in this past being real nostalgic about the situation is because you feel like you know it ended badly all right so y'all let me know what's going on in the comment section below i'm gonna chat with y'all later ciao